For my part, I urge the parties to consider all possibilities so that a solution to this dispute can be found within a reasonable time frame. I believe a solution to an issue that divides two neighboring countries is very much in the interest of both parties and would also greatly contribute to regional peace and security. In an effort to assist the parties in this process, I respectfully made some suggestions in the form of a draft framework for their consideration as a basis for an honorable and fair resolution. I have urged Ambassadors Dimitrov and Vasilakis to bring these suggestions to their governments for study. Λοιπόν, νομίζω ότι η συνάντηση αυτή θα χρησιμεύσει και για τους δύο να σκεφτούν το μέλλον. Ε, εγώ έκανα σαφές ποιε είναι οι αποφάσεις της ελληνικής κυβερνήσεως όπως έχουν διατυπωθεί και από τον Υπουργό και από τον Πρωθυπουργό και είπα ότι στη ζωή τίποτα δεν μένει σταθερό και ότι πρέπει να ξανασκεφθούν αυτά που λένε ότι είναι οριστικά διότι με τον τρόπο αυτό είμαστε γείτονε και πρέπει να φτάσουμε σε μια συμφωνία που θα ικανοποιεί και τους δύο διότι αν δεν ικανοποιηθούν και οι δύο θα είμαστε σε μια περιοχή όπου θα δημιουργούνται προβλήματα. Ο κύριος Νίμιτς μας είπε ορισμένε από τις σκέψεις του, τα διάβα... σας τα διάβασε προηγουμένως. Both sides expressed their views in a very uh, um, honest way. Uh, we know that there are certain problems. We want uh, to be uh, helpful. Both sides want to find a solution. There are still some views uh, which they have to be overcome. But I think uh, if the two countries uh, think over certain things, uh, that the economic cooperation between them is uh, more valuable than other uh, theoretical or uh, doctrinal positions, that will be helpful. The, the, we see the name as the pillar of our identity and uh, our stability. We need, as the last nation that got statehood in the Balkans, we need some basic dignity to continue and to go in the right direction. And that's why uh, we repeated basically uh, the position that we are very flexible when it comes to the bilateral communication with Greece, but we have to maintain the position that the constitutional name, we have a right uh, for a constitutional name to be used internationally by international organizations and other countries. Are you, are you? Thank you very much. Thank you so much.